second. I'm the coordinator for East Hampton City Arts Plus, and we organized and funded the project with the Massachusetts Cultural Council, and we're a city arts organization, so we're part of the city planning department, and the city committee came together and um, put out a call to artists, as well as selected the locations and helped with the installation and collaborating with the Department of Public Works. Yep, the city put out a call for proposals. Um, for we, artistic bike racks. Yep, sculptural bike sculptural racks, bike I think was the wording they used. And something like 22 hours before the deadline, we decided that really we should get around to putting a proposal together. So tell them that. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, we work in steel um, at Ben's shop, BMW Ironworks, just down the bike path over at the Eastworks building. And um, it seemed silly to not put in a design since that's you know, the medium we work in. <laughs> so you don't have a firm name for this. So we'll no. call it the geometric rack because yeah, it certainly is very geometric. And we're looking for yeah. any any ideas if you if you have an idea on what you might want to name it. But I, I think this one in particular shows the the nature of I think what East Hampton's turning into. The the idea that we can be different and still be practical. And this is different and practical and I think it's wonderful and it's it's really brightens up this, the area here and so we're very pleased with it. Thank you very much. Your work yeah. is wonderful. And um, I'm very pleased that ECA Plus and the Bike Rack Committee and all the folks that decided to work together and I'm happy that the DPW was able to help uh, in, in a small way and uh, so thank you very much. We did the Bear Fest in 2009 and 2012. Um, we've had three mural projects and this is a larger plan for East Hampton City Arts Plus to implement public art throughout the streets. There's also quite a bit of public art in the um, park behind us including benches and trash receptacles. We're very different. Um, I consider myself um, an artist but I never make functional work unless I'm doing my day job which is working for him in the metal shop. But my own work um, is sculpture, installation, lots of found objects, steel, foam, um, brightly colored materials. Sometimes it's performance based or video based. Um, so very different than this, although I get to have a little bit of my color in this piece. And he's a... I work almost entirely in the functional realm. Um, very rarely make sculptural pieces, but uh, architectural ironwork, um, fabricated <laughs> furniture, well, you're arriving by droves here. <laughs> Indeed. Uh, Cut that ribbon, they just all show up. That's yeah. right, yeah. I mean, who knew that you could put bikes on it before the ribbon was cut? <laughs> I'd like to invite the mayor and the bike rec committee and the artists to cut the ribbon. Does anyone want to run through it? <laughs> you know, they had to look not only at being sculptural, aesthetically pleasing, but also um, functional. So they had to act as bike racks and be utilized as bike racks. <laughs> Here, you want to help me cut it? Wow! Yay. Yay. That one really works. Yay. I hope you all pick your favorite one and find that your bike. It worked right. It worked really right. Yeah. Yep. It was satisfying. <laughs> we were friends at the beginning and friends throughout, and are still friends now. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>